Wait, wait, wait. In English? Yeah. Okay. What role do you see the Armenian diaspora playing in influencing the decisions and discussions in COP29? And what would you suggest them to do that day? Well, uh, like two months ago, I, no. no. Uh, on April 24, I was in Lebanon, I was in Germany, I was in different places, and they were discussing how to organize a campaign to free the hostages. And I participate in this social media campaign with using the same hashtags, COP29, stop the war genocide, free Armenian hostages, and that became very successful. If you open COP29, these two hashtags are at the top. So, and it's showing how the Armenians are connected because there are Armenians for 30 different countries doing that. So you are not alone in Armenia. The, I was involved in different channel sites in the world, and it's the first time I can see a global community working together. And that for me is fantastic. So the ability of Armenians to connect each other because Armenians you know, have different opinions on everything except on protecting Armenia. So there is something very important. All the Armenians in the world want to protect you and Nagorno Karabakh and release the prisoners, so the hostages. That's a common ground, and that's what we are doing. It's already happening. Now, we visit Armenia to understand more what is happening here. Also, tomorrow I'll have a meeting with the Catholicos, because the Catholicos want to do also be very active. And, uh, Yesterday I went to the south, I visited the border of Azerbaijan, I saw the people in the villages, uh, so for me it's great. Today I, I had a meeting with the Artsakh, the former leader, the leaders of Artsakh. So we are not involved in any national, local discussion, but we see this idea to protect Armenia, protect Nagorno-Karabakh, and free the hostages is common platform, and we are doing that. And we have two months more to work, and we are taking advantage of that. And I really feel that you have to understand Ar Armenians are not alone. Today I have visited with different universities also. They can do more to go to the, any international meeting here, have to see the people of Armenia demanding this. So we really need not to attack someone else, attack to put together the energy. And it's happening. Uh, Judge Afgarian was mentioning the U.S. State Department, Secretary Blinken, is asking for the release of the prisoners. So we'll get them. We'll get them. What should the diaspora do? Sorry? What should Armenian diaspora do? Well, at least they can join this. It's easy. In the morning you wake up, COP29, stop reaching, stop uh, watching green watch genocide, free Armenian hostages. That's it. And make any comment. I like the hashtag food. I, li I like the look how other people dance or whatever but with the same hashtag. That's the concept. Thank you.